Hi, I'm Chad. Hey, I'm Liz, and this is the Woodchoppers Ball October Intermediate Lindy Class 2023. This is Class 3. <laughs> okay, Class 3. Today uh, we are starting with egg beaters as we have been doing with our rotating rock step, but we are going to show you a new step out of the egg beater. So here's our egg beaters. Egg beater. And then we're going to do what we call a tornado turn. And then a tuck turn from here, double tuck. And then we're in open position. And if we're doing send out. Right. Six count send out. Six count send or out. Eight, it can be eight count too. <laughs> so um, those were mostly rotating steps. So like for example, the egg beater, if we could show that one more time, this involves rotation, tornado involves rotation. It's all in the hips. Rotating your hips, arcing rock step. Now we're gonna move into linear movement. So the first thing that we wanna look at when we're doing linear movement is a, what's called a one inch rock step. I'll let you explain that. Yeah comes from Bruce Lee's one inch punch. <laughs> Bruce Lee was a Hong Kong cha-cha champion before he was a martial artist. Fascinating. So, yes. So instead of punching, we're gonna use it to rock step. <laughs> so what happens is my hips move forward to rock step my partner. Instead of leaning forward and pushing, sure. we don't like that. I'm using my body mass to get my follower to move. Just like that. Notice that the, uh, can you do it one more time, but notice that this hand connection does not go anywhere. The lead is all in the hips, it's in the hips moving forward. And as you can say, see, this is what initiates the linear movement. So from here, if we're in open position, let's say just one hand, so leader's left, follower's right, and Chad does a one inch rock step, we can do, for example, a right side pass. And that's a six count move. Um, and then we also wanted to look at, actually let's show that, sorry, let's show that one more time on this side. So one inch rock step and then right side pass. Three, and four, five, and six. And then we also wanted to look at five of the swing out. Oh yes. Right? Can we talk about that? So the five the swing out. Most people are doing swing outs like this, but if you over rotate, you, there's no out. So I'm trying I to- I don't get any momentum. There's no momentum. So the idea is even if you hook your rock step, you want to change weight right here to get your follower to go out. And again, notice that our hand connection doesn't move anywhere, so there's no pushing or pulling. This is all a body lead, so we'll show it one more time. Two, three, and four, and then lead with your body yep. to get this thing out to happen. Yep. Okay, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Yay, <laughs> Wood Chopper's Ball. Thank you for having us.